Hello everybody, back here again for our vlog of day, and today is Tuesday the 30th, and today was a lovely, beautiful day to be alive. Got this morning, early night I wanted to, but got up and around, uh, wife got off to work, and I got a couple things accomplished, and then decided to work on the truck today again, uh, before the dog got here, because it feels weird to be underneath the jack stands and jack and having a dog bump it and that kind of thing and put me at risk it just seems a little on the sketchier side so went ahead and got work on it some end up cutting out the rusted line the spot where it's at and got that patched back up and got the flaring tool out and all that good fun stuff involved and got it patched back up and everything else there and then it's time to put the brakes and it took what well, seemed like way forever but it finally got to that we got much done so it's time to blew the brakes and you need two people to bleed brakes, but they make a kit that you can buy. You can do it yourself. Basically, it pulls a vacuum on the um, brake, brake bleeder that basically pulls the fluid through, and then you cap it off, you pump pressure up, and you pull it through, and so on and so forth. So I'm like, this shouldn't be that big a deal. And looked, Amazon had them for like 14 bucks. I'm like, not a big deal. It's not great, but I've seen them used, so I'm like, can't be that bad. So I went ahead and ordered it. It says next day shipping. I'm like, yeah, we'll be fine. Um, no big deal. I got to take my father-in-law to the doctor Thursday. That's the plan I think right now. So went ahead and said, heck with it. That won't be a problem. So, um, put in the cart, got a couple other things also. And it's like I said, it's next day delivery, which is great. So I go look and about an hour and a half later. Or so I look in there and it says it'll be here on like the fifth or something. I'm like, what the fuck? What do you mean the fifth? Like today's the, th like, what are you talking about? Like, no, uh, -uh. it says tomorrow. So I go and look, I go back and look and make sure. I'm like, well, maybe something screwed up in that one's shipping. And I look at the next one, it says it'll be here tomorrow. So I order it again. And then I look and it says it'll be here on the 5th. So I cancel both of those. And then I find a different one that says it'll be here next day. Ordered it and it says it'll be here on the 5th. And I'm like, how is it the 5th? Like that's a week away. Like even two day shipping would be better than this. Like what's going on here? Couldn't figure it out. So I even ordered a, uh, canceled that one. So I even ordered a fancier, much more expensive one. It was like five times the price. So I'm like, the heck with it. And it says it'll be here on the 8th. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on, Amazon? I'm like, you're still telling me this is next day shipping. I'll have this stuff next day. And you guys are telling me like, you know, eight days out. Like, what's going on here? Like, they're nine days out. This is ridiculous. So I was like, the hell with it. Had, um, had a client reach out that was dropped their dog off to me. And I'm in that weird world of like, I'm kind of stuck right now. Uh, what's going on? And I thought, well, I think I might have time. If I jump in the motorcycle quick, I can run up to the auto parts store. And um, when I was there early yes, yesterday, I had stopped by and bought some fluid and bought a bleeder cup that they said, yeah, that's all you need, one man thing, everything included in the kit. And all it is, the jar that has, you fill a fluid, you fill a brake fluid, and then you pump your brakes, and as the fluid comes out, it goes in there, and then basically what it does, it creates a block, so it won't let it um, basically fill back air, let the air back in, so. But the problem with that is, is the sound effect. How are you doing today? So the problem with that is I can't see if the bubbles are still kind of aligned or not. I don't know if it's doing any good. So it becomes that weird world of what good is this going to do me? Because I, if I'm inside the truck pumping the brakes, I don't know if the fluid is coming out solid or coming out in bubbles. I'd have no way of knowing. So. Now I'm like trying to figure out, do I try and set up like a GoPro? Do I try and set up like this? It's ridiculous. So didn't even open it. I brought it home, looked on YouTube and saw what it was. I'm like, this is worthless to me. So I can do the same thing with a Mountain Dew bottle or a Mason jar. It does me no good at all. So I uh, thought, well, I got time. I'm going to run it back. So I jumped the Marcel ramp there, returned it. And I'm like, I think I got time before they get here. No big deal. So sure enough. And they, I returned it to that one, went to the next door, which I called by the way and said, hey, do you have the one with the vacuum pump? I need the one with the hand vacuum pump. Do you have it in stock? And they're like, yep, let me go check. So she goes and checks. Yep, got it right here. I said, with the vacuum pump. She goes, yes, let me do a price check. And so it was like, I don't know, 15 bucks. Or I'm like, yeah, it's 13 bucks on Amazon, 15 bucks there. It sounds all right. I said, okay, I'll be up there shortly. So I drive up there and I, I told the guys looking for the brake thing. He goes, oh, did you call her? And I said, yeah. He goes, oh yeah, she left it up here for you. I'm like, cool, walk there. And it's the same damn thing that was at the other part store but it's two bucks more here. And I said, I specifically asked this vacuum ground, like, what the fuck? So I was annoyed. So I basically left it. They had another kit there. Same exact kit, just fancier name on it for like $70. That's 14 on Amazon. 
And I'm like, oh, you gotta be shitting me. So I was like, nope, the hell with that. So I jumped back on the bike. And at that point, I get a text from the dog owners dropping off, saying they're on my street. And I am about maybe, I don't know, three quarters of a mile, half mile, probably half mile behind them at that point. So I said, hey, I'm on my way back. I'll be there shortly. So I race back to the house. Um, they're there. When I get there, pop the garage door open, get the dog dropped off. Everything's good to go. They're heading up to him to do a, some kind of procedure at the hospital. Got to spend the night. So I just got the dog to one night. So at that point, I don't have the right tools I need. So I look back on Amazon. Everything I look at says it'll be here next day. I order it, put it in my cart, hit the order button. It says between five and eight days away. And I'm like, fuck this. So I look on Harbor Freight. They say they got like 40 of them in stock, which tells me inventory's off, but they should have some. So I was like, I'll go up tomorrow after they drop, or pick the dog up, and I'll go pick up the little cheap one. 25 bucks there instead of 14 on Amazon, but who cares? And I'll just get it there, and I'll be able to do it myself, and it'll all be good to go. So, but yeah, that's kind of what we're looking at that whole process and see what happens in that world. But yeah, as of right now, no good luck. So, Went ahead and buttoned up the truck best I could. Um, dog was there, so we hung out, we played. Guy my side, he's super excited. He's also annoyed there's no dogs to play with because he wants to play with dogs. He's a big giant, gigantic, um, great Pyrenees, and just such a good ball. So hung around there a little bit. Got a couple things accomplished here and there, nothing too major. Came time for me to get my run in. So went and got my run in, uh, got back, ended up making um, the um, Dorito lasagna that I was talking about making yesterday. I uh, basically it was, I don't know, it was like 6 30. Obviously, home like 5 5 30. You just got to five home by 5 30 usually. Never, you know, usually at six the latest. And so let me know it's now like 6 45. I'm like, well, I'm eating in like 45 minutes. So it's up to you if you want to be here or not for it. So went ahead and chucked it in the oven. Um, got my shower. She got home from work and <coughs> we had a little bit, pulled the meal out of the oven. And we had dinner, finished uh, Run Rabbit Run. I don't know. It was an all right movie. It was not spectacular by any means. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, from there, I'll head back outside, play the dog. Dog ate dinner real well, which is not normally like him, but overall, it's pretty good. So, yeah, got that taken care of, and it was all wrapped up and done. Had myself a nice cigar outside. Eventually, headed back in. Wife went to bed early, so I ended up was outside pretty late, letting her get as much sleep as she could. I knew the dog would wake her up when we got in. But we got in there and it was all good. So anyway, that's all I got for now. Talk to you guys tomorrow. Have yourself a safe, wonderful day. Thanks for watching.